Hello guys, uh, welcome to Linux Automations. In today's class, we are going to talk about a Rundeck installation. So I already have a server. Um, I'm just trying to connect to that particular server over SSH. Okay, so let's see how do you install Rundeck. Go to your website, which is rundeck.org, so and there you'd be seeing download Rundeck. So as my machine, which I am going to try over here, or which I am running over here, so which is uh, CentOS 7, so that's the reason I would be selecting the distribution as uh, M-based installation. So here you can see uh, M-based installation, so you better uh, try this one. So to start the Rundeck, it's an application from Java, so you require Java. So yeah, I'm install Java and you install the latest repo file from uh, Rundeck. And finally, install the render package. So finally, you can start the service as per the documentation given over here, you can start the service. But I would like to do a small modification over here, uh, whereas I would like to update the IP address of my uh, uh, my configuration to the IP address of my server. Okay, so here I'm using a cloud server. So that's the reason I'm going with uh, public IP address. In case if you are using a local machine, you can update your uh, local IP address in this configuration, which I'm trying to show you. The configuration file for your Rundeck is etc Rundeck Rundeck config properties, and here you'll be seeing server URL, so which is pointing to localhost, and you better change the localhost with the IP address. So that is all the configuration. You just save and quit, and you start the service systemctl start. Rundeck D. So it's going to listen on port number 4040 as you have seen in the configuration. You can just verify that one by using netstat lntp. So as it, in, as it is an application, so it just takes a couple of minutes to come up online. You can see the process is running in meanwhile. Please have any grip for um, search for uh, run deck. So here you can see process is running. So that is fine, but the port will take just a couple of minutes to come up. So you can see here, okay, the port number 4040 is up and running. Now you can go to the browser and hit the IP address colon 4040. So it's going to take you the Rundeck, Rundeck uh, portal, so which we have installed right now. And it asks for the default username and password, so which is in our, I mean, in, not in our case, the, this version of Rundeck, so which is 2.7.2.7111. The default username is admin, and the password is also admin. So it's a best practice you log in and change the password. And you can log in. By using default username and password and here you got the Rundeck portal so from here you can do the things whatever you would like to do or create a job or adding the notes creating projects everything under Rundeck. 
so that's all about the installation and thank you for watching please subscribe to my channel thank you have a good day